Hello and welcome to Study with Sudhir. This is your digital classroom. My name is T.S. Sudhir. You recall on the 26th of January, that is Republic Day, we had put out an SWS January challenge, that is to finish the entire history and civics ICSC class 10 syllabus in six days between the 26th of January and the 31st of January. I'm delighted to inform you that the response from the students has been huge. It has been overwhelming. So many students writing to me over YouTube comments, over Instagram DM, over email, over our SWS app comments that they have decided to take up the challenge and some of them have actually managed to finish a significant part of the entire syllabus satisfactorily till now. So definitely by the 31st, they would be able to finish off most of the syllabus. In fact, I would think a large majority would be able to finish it off by Sunday, that is the 30th of January. And uh, this has really helped them get their academic life back on track because so many of them were also complaining about how they seem to have lost the focus and the momentum and the energy. So this has given them a new direction as it were. And I really feel very happy because that's precisely the role that we see for SWS to be a positive force, not COVID positive, but a positive force, be a voice that can be trusted, be a mentor who guides students the right way to do the right things. Right being the keyword. Okay. ICSC students ko sab kuch keywords ke hisab se samjhana padta hai. Truth, quality, commitment. I mean, frankly speaking, these are the only things that we actually focus on. Be truthful, not put out any fake news and be committed to the cause of quality. Now, the question that arises is, what do you do next? According to the schedule of your pre-board examinations in your school, and we had done a, a video on how you should approach pre-board examinations. Now, some schools pre-board examinations are starting from the 7th of Feb, some from the 2nd of Feb, some from the 14th or the 20th of Feb. So depending on the pre-board examination schedule of your school, I want you to work out a schedule for any two subjects, right? If you have time, supposing your exams are starting only from the 15th or in the second half of February, right? So let's say, for example, you are a science student. Now, I would think chemistry syllabus, given its three big units, that is metallurgy, study of compounds and organic chemistry, would take roughly at an average of about three, three and a half hours every day, you would take about maximum six days, right? And I will tell you some of the points that you need to bear in mind, right? Along with that, combine, say, English literature, two poems and two stories. Don't do MOV right now. You could look at only the two poems and the two stories so that it adds as some kind of a relief from studying too much of chemistry. Put these two together and say the next six days, I am going to devote to chemistry and treasure trove, right? Focus on that and I do believe you would be able to do that if you don't touch MOV for now because if you do the treasure trove, you would be taking care of roughly, you know, almost uh, more than half the syllabus as far as your English 2 paper is concerned. Now, in chemistry, I want you to kind of pay attention to one aspect. That is, please make sure you are studying from someone who is really in command of the subject, knows the subject very well. It could be your school teacher. Please reach out to him or her seek time, seek extra time and get your all your doubts and fundas cleared. It could be your private tuition teacher. It could be SWS. This chemistry, the first reading is not a subject where you should be seeking help only from your fellow classmates or any other friend, right? Seek out the help of a professional, qualified, quality teacher. As I said, your school teacher, your tuition teacher or SWS where we also do the chemistry formula course. So do that, just textbook reading will not suffice, will not suffice. So I'm telling this to you loud and clear, do this in the interest of good marks in chemistry, a 40 on 40. Also remember that if you have revised history and civics, doesn't mean that you do not touch history and civics again. Every three to four days, go back to history and civics, pick up one chapter, say the prime minister chapter or the Supreme Court chapter or the World War II chapter, and just do a quick revision and see whether you are able to remember things or not, right? So please 
revisit it every two three days so that you are able to keep in touch with what you have studied don't say that okay i have done this history and civics syllabus now i will see it only before the exams do not make that mistake a few students have been asking me when will sws put out its question papers because our semester one question papers were absolutely outstanding quality so many students want a repeat sws 2.0 for semester two so we will unveil the entire series one by one starting 15th or 20th of february okay because i believe the next 20 days is when you should focus on studying and revising the syllabus do not invest in question banks in a big way right now you could look at some question papers some questions here and there right but not the entire question banks that's not the time to do now so what we are doing now to give you a glimpse a sneak peek of what is on offer what is going to be on offer and also to test you how much have you studied history and civics how much have you studied chemistry how much have you studied english literature or biology over the next four days okay uh, you are going to have a question paper a free test paper on the sws app which you can attempt for absolutely free these are going to be mcq based question papers to give you a sense of well how well you have studied so far okay so that's what we are doing so the first one will be history civics the second one will be chemistry the third one will be english literature and the fourth one will be biology okay so starting between now and the 2nd of february we are rolling out these four free test papers we are calling it test with sws so just have a look at it it will give you an idea about what will be on offer and there will be many test papers many test papers which will roll out after the second the third week of february okay so if you have revised with all these subjects these chapters please go and attempt these tests the link to the sws gap uh, app is given in the description box all the best to you thank you very much for watching